when you fired Elaine Vigneault in December and didn't fire Chuck Fletcher, I said it was a mistake, and I've said it every day since. You kept an incompetent GM in place to oversee the trade of your captain, Claude Giroux. You've kept him in place to oversee a trade deadline. You've kept him to oversee the lead-up to and the actual NHL draft. You've now kept him in place to go through free agency. And when you said a few months ago, if you're Dave Scott or if you're Chuck Fletcher, that you're going to do an aggressive retool, you sold fans on the concept that this was going to be something that would turn around quickly. You hired a coach who is not a project. It is not a development coach. You hired a guy who's brought in here to maximize the assets he has and to put you into contention of some sort, whether it's this year or in the next two years. You made every signal to this fan base that you were going to make every effort to make this team competitive worthwhile and worth money around the time that season ticket holders were going to re-up their tickets. And what you did is you turned around, pulled wool over their eyes, and smacked them in the back of the head. This is an absolute abhorrent thing. And if this were any team in Philadelphia other than the Philadelphia Flyers, the calls for Chuck Fletcher's job would be 24-7 on the Fanatic and on WIP. But because the Flyers have fallen out of relevancy in the way that they have over the last, say, five years, the sports stations are talking about it in as much as they're going to talk about it. The fans are upset. Money has been spent. And people feel duped. And now what you've done is you have somehow figured out a way to unite the analytics community, the Broad Street Bullies community. You've taken people who support Snow the Goalie. You've taken people who support Broad Street Hockey. You've taken people who support High and Wide and O and B and whatever Jason Martinez is doing. And you've somehow unified them all into hating what you have done to this team. And you've taken any excitement that could have existed for the season, and you have buried it. You, Chuck Fletcher, you've done that. And you, Dave Scott, you've done that by allowing him to stay.